The victim in what's being called one of Miami's grossest crimes has been identified. 66-year-old Ronald Popo remains in the hospital after police say 31-year-old Rudy Eugene attacked him Saturday, biting his face, tearing it into pieces. Surveillance video from a nearby building captured the incident. I saw one of the most bloodiest and goriest scenes I've, I've ever been to. It was actually extremely, uh, not only grotesque, but it was just very sad. The amount of uh, blood and um, it was very sad to see what happened to this gentleman that had his face eaten. It's not clear what led Eugene, seen on the left, to attack Popo, seen on the right. Both men can be seen near a busy highway as the attack begins. Later, after police arrive, an officer fatally shoots Eugene. Once the officer discharged his firearm and, and, and shot the subject, the subject growled at him and continued to, to maul the, the, the victim. There is no doubt in my mind that if, if a bullet isn't going to stop the subject, a taser or an asp or any other piece of uh, equipment that we carry would have been able to stop him. Police haven't released details of an autopsy on Eugene's body that was scheduled for Tuesday. It could be weeks before the results of toxicology tests are available. Matt Small, The Associated Press.